was a time when the ring of the anvil was a familiar sound in every town and village. The blacksmith's hammer has grown to a powerful machine that multiplies the strength of his muscles a thousandfold. show man there's all walks of life crazy people good looking ugly looking fat people it's all good that's a good question I've used so many of them for so long I don't think I have a favorite tool anymore a hammer <laughs> Just I'd say my lathe my lathe for sure my metal lathe yeah, I just geek out on it super hard. The one I use the most, plain Jane, open-ended wrench. It's gotta be the grinder. Welder's probably the favorite tool because you can pretty much make and fix anything that you mess up. Who cares, I'll never get lonesome. Spark plug wrench. It's two stroke, man. <laughs> we have an ax, machete, we have a grenade back here. Plenty of lighting, it's super bright. This actually, we road race it, we MX race it, and we hill climb it, so it's, it's a triple purpose bike. Kind of went with a uh, hybrid uh, tracker, cafe racer, street fighter. I'm never gonna buy a $3,000 CX500 piece of shit versus a $1,200 R6 that has 100 horsepower. It's basically a collage. It's cool. <laughs> it's cozy. Feels nice. Bondo, frame mods, molding. Hours. Forget it. Hate it. Don't ever want to do it again. I wanted to try and make an exhaust thread like a you know, nut and bolt. I don't know if I just got lucky or what, because I, I probably wouldn't attempt it again. I, I wanted it to look like one of our bikes, but like a piece of popcorn that pops, you know? <laughs> To be honest, it's that part. hammer like this. Your thumb is flat on, not like this, like that. This is how you use it. Okay, not like this. You want to hit hard, relax your grip. Lecture over. Jack is bitching today. Absolutely primo. 
We're here at the flat track races. First time ever we've done this as part of the show. The pro events, we've got some of the top guys in the country. First place is uh, five grand. This is my favorite part, to be honest, with you, coming out here to race. The smaller the dirt track, within reason, the better. The track's too big, you go too fast, and in three weeks, all your riders are in the stands. Broken leg, arm, collarbone. It's a great for the fans.